Hey everyone, welcome back to another video on Pop Explosion. I'm Sean. I'm Tess. And today we are doing part two of our haul for the last few months. So stay tuned. Okay, so uh, as I said, today is part two of our three-part series where we're going through everything from our haul for the last few months. Uh, if you saw our last video, I'll put it up here. It was uh, Forbidden Planet. Today we will go through our haul from Disney Store, GameStop, and we have a pickup from Adverts and uh, from Primark. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll start with the Disney store. So if you saw in the last one, um, we picked up a, fi a figure from Forbidden Planet um, and I picked this up to go along with it to do some cool photos. And it is the Thanos Marvel Select figure uh, that was exclusive to Disney store, I believe. Well, it was exclusive to Disney store over here. Um, so again, that will be coming out of box and we'll be taking some cool photos uh, to go with the orange spoiler, orange spoiler that we picked up in Forbidden Planet. So once we do that we'll do a video on that, opening the boxes and uh, doing a review on those figures as well. Well in Disney Store we also picked up this and it was on sale. Um, I don't know what it's going to be like but for the value of it we had to pick it up, it was really cool. And there wasn't many left, so it was the only one left that we could actually pick up. Um, and it is a... Fluffy Puffy. Fluffy Puffy. And it is Daisy Duck. So we'll just open this up quickly here, just to see what it's like. And just so you can see... Okay. It is, yeah, just so, so the original, yeah. There, you can make that out. The original price, and if you can see that, was 25 euros, and we picked it up for four euros. So we had to, we yeah. had to pick it up. We couldn't say no. And um, on the side. Even if we don't like it, we can give it to Shay. Yeah. She will definitely like it. And if she doesn't, Lana will definitely, definitely like it. <laughs> yeah. But for four euros. That's for something that's normally 25. Yeah. I can't say no. So let's see what this looks like. Okay, it's very light. Mm -hmm. So I don't know if I pay or I definitely won't pay 24 euros for it. Oh, it's small. Oh, this one. I can hide it with me. Okay, so we'll take it out of the bag. It's in the bag. Okay, so it's okay. Not what I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be like um, uh, porcelain or delf, but it's it's actually uh, part of it is flocked, but it's it's like it's vinyl, like that type of the plasticky part. The, the the actual feather part is actually flocked. Yeah, I'm gonna stand. I don't know how. Is that? Stand? Is that? No. It's don't know what that is. Maybe it's like... I have no idea. So we got this little extra part as well. I have no idea what it's for. But there's the figure anyway. Um, is it worth 25 euros? Probably not. In my opinion? No, definitely not. Um, see that? It's a cool little figure. Um, yeah, we might. We'll throw it up on the shelf. For 4 euros, yeah, definitely not bad. Um, no way I would have paid 24 euros for it though. Absolutely no way. Mm -hmm. Still, that's going. I have no idea what this is for. I'm trying to find what that thing is. Yeah. But it's all in like Japanese or something. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea. If anyone has ever seen this before, these figures, and seen this um, little piece. Looks like it fits on something. If anyone knows what that's for. Um, put it down in the comments below and let us know because we are 
<laughs> stumped. Yeah, I was gonna yeah. sink. No it. idea. <laughs> no idea. Okay, so we'll throw that there. Okay, so for four euros. Yeah. We'll throw it up on the shelf, it's cool. Okay, so next we'll do this one. Okay, so this one I got is a pickup from Adverts and it's from the uh, SDC, 2019 SDCC and it is the San Diego Comic Con, 50th uh, Comic Con uh, Toucan. And if you can see there, he has the San Diego or the SDCC uh, shirt on. Really cool. I thought that would be a cool one to add to the collection. Something different. So that's cool. I like the shirt, the shirt is cool. So the sticker. Oh, I didn't even realize. It's cool, isn't it? And then this one we picked up from Primark, as we call it over here in Ireland, Pennies. Um, and it is, it was ex yeah, it's metallic, so it's red, red metallic Batman that was exclusive to Target in the States, I believe. But over in the UK and Ireland, it was exclusive to Primark. Now I'm not sure about the, I'm not sure about the, the Primark sticker. Uh, yeah. It's quite big, but uh, still, it's an exclusive, and it's another Batman to add to our collection, which is cool. And it has the um, 80 year anniversary box, which is really cool. I love those boxes. Okay, next we go to GameStop. So what I'll do is I'll open this one because I picked this up already. So I picked up this uh, Ready Player One and it's the Gregarious Games Luminart. Um, so it's like it's one of those that actually lights up. So we'll take it out of the box and see if it's actually has batteries or not in it. It says touch activated. Touch activated. Oh, so it's actually a USB. Um, that's cool. So I don't have a USB near me that I can use. But what I'll do is uh, once I get it lighted up, I'll put a photo uh, and we'll put it up uh, here. Somewhere here, and you can see what it's like uh, lit up. That's cool. I thought that was a cool thing to have in the room and um, to go with the Ready Player One collection. I don't think it's going to be that big. Yeah, it's quite thick, isn't it? Let's show you there. It's like a, a book type. Yeah, cool. I, I like it. I'm a big fan of Ready Player One. Um, we have most of the Ready Player One collection. Um, you saw on our Instagram lately, I put a post up. Um, we're missing maybe four out of the entire set, and that's including the um, chases and exclusives. So we're missing the Jade Sixer, the Glow in the Dark Sixer, the Iron Giant, and the Antique Parzival is all we're missing. Um, I like it. But like I haven't really watched it that much. I've yeah. watched it maybe a few times though. It's because it's more because it's so much pop culture um, and stuff related to the eighties and nineties stuff. Like I like it so much. I think so many references to stuff that I would have watched when I was younger. Okay, so get the classic off this eventually. Okay, so there's no buttons. It's actually just one of those. Yeah, you just touch it and it will come on. That's cool. Yeah, can't wait to see what that's like when it's over. Should be good. Okay. Okay, so I'm just throw that down there. Okay, now these are all for Tess, so I'll let Tess open them all. Okay, we got Harry Potter, we got Ron Weasley. Cool, so we now have all three uh, from the trio, Harry, Ron, and Hermione with the Mandrake. Okay, next. We got Lucius Malfoy. Yeah, that's cool. We don't have him. No, we do now. <laughs> <laughs> Not sure if we have many in that set, actually. Um, we have... Mm, I don't know. No. I don't think we have any of them. We've, we, we've Minerva and McGonagall, that's it. It's the only one we have out of that set. So and then we have one this of the, one. Yeah. 
So I'm gonna just have to start with another one. Pink another one. Cool. Gilderoy Lockhart. And we already have his uh, exclusive when he's in the blue suit. So now we have the normal one as well. Cool, so this is the normal Tom Riddle. Um, if you've seen before, we also have the uh, Sepia Tom Riddle. So now that actually completes that set. Except for... I'll show you here. So we now have this entire set, normal. Plus we have the exclusive Gilderoy, the exclusive uh, Tom Riddle. The only one we're missing is the Glow in the Dark um, Nearly Headless Nick. For to complete that set, including all the exclusive, but for the comments, yeah, we've got that set completely. I love this one, it's Picket yeah. from um, Pink Panther. Yeah, it's yeah. Cass has wanted this one for a while. Yeah, it is, it is a cool pop, it's actually really cool out of the box. Yeah, it looks like it's like an actual thing, like a planet, kind of, because it has like a kind of. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we have Harry yeah. with the Marauder's Map. We don't have that one. No, we, we have, have Ram with Scabbers. We have we Lupin. Don't. We do? Do we? Yeah. Hold on. He's down there. Number 45. And oh. um, we, oh yeah. And then we have the Lupin as Werewolf exclusive as well. Yeah, but we don't have So now we two. have Ginny. And we don't have, have Luna one. or Peter Pettigrew. Do we not have Hermione? No. Yeah. No, we don't. Cool. So it's another cool one to add to the collection. One of the older ones. Yep. Okay. So that was a nice quick part uh, just to clear up those ones. The last thing we have now is uh, our haul from Smiths. Which yeah, is quite large as well. So <laughs> yeah. what we'll do is we'll end this video here um, as part two and we'll go into it. We have two of these left. We might as well open them now. What okay. do you think? Yeah. We haven't opened these in a while. It's our last two. And if you remember from previous videos, it's the Point Size Heroes Science Fiction. Um, we've already, I think we've already got all the exclusives that we could get. Um, yeah, we got the Alien yeah, Facehugger, the Predator and Captain Kirk. So there's still one or two left that we don't have that I wanted to get. Um, we got, That's we got the Lilu, didn't we? Did we get the Lilu? Yeah. Oh, there you are. Yeah, we got the, the Lilu and we got Doc Brown. So I want to get Marky McFly. What's that? This one. Oh, yeah. And I want to get Neo from The Matrix. So, What's that? We don't have that. That's an alien. Thing. We do have. Oh, no, we don't have the alien either. So. Is that the alien? Yeah. Yeah, I thought I recognized it. Yeah. So, let's see what we got. 
the mother exclusive, so we got the face hugger from Alien again, which we already have, and we also got another Emilio. So, two, two duplicates. We'll go into our giveaway box to again add it in as extras. Okay, so that's it for this video. Um, hope you liked it. If you hit the like button. If you really like this, subscribe button. And don't forget to ring that bell. And we'll see you in part three. Slum. Bye.